What's up guys, Carlos and Alexa here, and we have a special announcement. I don't even have to say anything. I think we just hold this thing up. Bing! Oh, you have one too. I did. You made another one. I'm a peeing machine. What did that one say? Pregnant? Mine too. Are you pregnant? Yeah. Are we pregnant? We're pregnant. We're pre oh, I was gonna high five okay, you. Okay, just give me a hug. <laughs> Yes, that so, uh, is the special announcement. We're pregnant. We are pregnant. Uh, well, she is, and I'm just part of it because I'm the husband. Well, you're pregnant too. Yeah, I know. Kind of. Yes. <laughs> this has been, it's really, it's been a really fun journey. Yeah. Um, when did we decide that we wanted to, kind of, well, you wanted to get pregnant really early. Yeah. Like, Carlos was ready for babies. Um, but after, after dancing, we decided, you know what, I think now's a good time. I think... I think we're ready to get pregnant, but the journey is not that simple. It's not as easy as like, No, no, okay. no, 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 it's, it's a lot harder uh, than you think. I thought for sure it'd be like, one, two, three, wham, bam, we're, oops. <laughs> one, two, three, wham, bam, we're pregnant. But no, no, that's 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 not the case. You gotta keep trying and trying and trying and, and trying some more, which, you know. But, but we, learned a, bad we learned a lot along the way. Okay. I mean, there are all of these things that people want you to try, they want you to like, Take your temperature every morning. Make sure not to get out of bed. You have to take your temperature while you're under the covers and all these like weird things. And finally, um, after like trying apps and all this stuff, we decided we're like, we're just gonna buy an ovulation kit. She decides. <laughs> okay, she decided I decided I'm gonna buy an just ovulation to clarify. kit. Because I'd never tried it before and it seemed uh it seemed simpler. Yeah. And I have to say it really was. We got uh, we purchased one of those clear blue ovulation kits where you get the little happy faces and it was really exciting because <laughs> because literally um, you, you pee on a stick and it lets you know when you're ovulating and kind of for how long yeah. and it's hilarious yeah. because Carlos would be at work filming and he would just get a text message of this happy face and I'd be like you need to get home right now because we got a happy face. I was at the gym and then I couldn't work out because I had to go home. And get another workout in. Carlos! Is, is oh that my bad? gosh. It might That's be. That's how you make a baby. It might be. That's how you make a baby. <laughs> um, anyway, oh. uh, it's just been, it's been so much fun. And, and I think it just helped take the stress off of things. And I think, you know, it's so hard because women already tend to overthink things anyway. And when you want to get pregnant, you just want it to happen right away. And when it doesn't happen, you think like, is something wrong with me? Or what am I not doing right? When, yeah. when really it's just your body adjusting to. Well, and we literally were just like, you know what? Let's not, but let's not worry about it anymore. When God wants us to have a baby, we're gonna have a baby yeah. and that's it. Pregnancy so far has been crazy and exciting. Um, I will say though, my first trimester, I have had a lot of morning sickness. <laughs> oh, a lot of morning sickness. Sorry. Man, it, it was awful. Literally, we would be somewhere and I'd be like, oh, I'm so excited. We're finally gonna get to see the show. I gotta go. I'm sorry it was so hard for you. It was so hard for me. It was so hard for me. You hear about morning sickness, which by the way, is not morning sickness. It's all day long sickness. But they don't talk about pregnancy fatigue that much. It's a very real thing. I mean, there were days where I just wanted to sleep in bed all day long and I did. And Carlos was like, yes, what is wrong with you? Are you okay? But that's just part of the journey. And I have so much more energy now, which is amazing. And I feel like a different person. You are a different person. Thank you. Thank and you. And you got a little bit of, of a person in your belly. I have a little person. She's about. literally building oh, wait, a human. I brought in, I brought in our little picture. Can you guys look at what a cutie pie this is? Yeah. You guys are going to see this little cutie pie. We don't know what it is yet, but whatever it is, it's Perfect. Yeah, we, we really want a girl, but we also really want a boy. So I don't I really. I think we're really happy with either or. I just want to have the baby, and uh, it's crazy. <laughs> Mackie got us like all these like baby clothes, and I I I, I think that's when it like really sunk in for me because I saw I was like I was like holding up these baby clothes, and I was like these are so tiny. You mean a little human is gonna fit inside of this thing? Yeah. No, no. A when little human. Your hands were inside. so much bigger. Than I was those like, oh. too. You're like holding them. No, yesterday I was driving down, and I was like, I can't wait till he or she is older, and we're, we're like driving, and I'm like, put your seatbelt on. <laughs> I'm just saying, when our kid gets in the car, yeah. All I have to do is give a look. Oh yeah. Put the seatbelt on. Okay. They and, won't mess with mom. Oh no, but like maybe they'll mess with they're daddy. They're a child. When they're driving, they're gonna be like, what does this red button do? 
I'm 26 years old and I see a red button. I'm He's like, still pushing all I'm the red like, buttons. I'm like, what does this red button do? What does this red button do? Well, when somebody puts a red button out there, it's like, Oh my God. We're super excited. I mean, this is this is the, the next we're chapter. We're so happy to share life, this with you. And we are so excited to be sharing this with you. Um, sorry that we haven't been posting any vlogs. We are currently uh, on a uh, sailboat right now. We're currently on a sailboat right now. So we made this video before for you guys. Yes, we did. Because we wanted to release it right in time for Father's Day. Because guess what? I want to be a father. How weird is that? I can be a mom. <laughs> How weird. I mean, it's like. It's, oh, wait, hold on. Look at what? Oh, thank You're you. You're like my baby. Oh, thank you for now. <laughs> we're, we're never gonna have another normal Christmas. We're never gonna have another normal Thanksgiving. Well, our normal, like just us. Yeah, It's yes. gonna be a great. Yes, amazing. but I'm saying like, it's never gonna be the same. Like, it's always gonna be different from now on. It's crazy. Uh, so we're super excited, like I keep saying. We're super excited to be sharing this with you guys. And, and we're gonna be posting so, so much so, so much stuff. So many videos. <laughs> I don't know. When the baby goes to school. Oh, the wow. The baby will teach us. <laughs> wow. But um, I will say the hardest part about this whole process was not saying anything. Oh. It's so hard We not like just anything. recently, like. <laughs> told our families. We just recently told our families and, and, and our agents and our managers and our close friends. And it's like our, our, our little group of like, Eight people now know. <laughs> it's it, eight people. Eight, yeah, we have. We have but people. now all you guys know, <laughs> so we can share the excitement with you. Um, and I just keep looking at this thing, and I'm like, it's I have to so say though. Okay, good. hold on. I actually, I, I never talked about this, and I really want to talk about this. I just took my pregnancy. <laughs> when I first took my pregnancy test, you know. You have all of these ideas like, okay, I'm going to surprise my husband, I'm going to put it in a box, I'm going to make it look like a present, or you, you come up with all these clever ideas of how you're going to like share this news with your significant other. It goes completely out the window. I don't know if other women have felt this way, but for me, I thought, I thought, okay, I had this feeling that like, I might be pregnant, I was feeling a little off. And I just said, we had just finished a cruise um, and we got back from the trip and I immediately went to the restroom and I took a pregnancy test and I did not want to look at it because I was kind of, not afraid, but I just didn't want to see another not pregnant. <laughs> so I just kind of let it sit on the counter and out of the corner of my eye, I see this little oh, pregnant. The funny thing is that it's not like it's like, oh, can I mistake this? No, like, it no. just says pregnant. <laughs> it's not like, like oh, maybe, the, uh, maybe am I I'm... reading it wrong? No, <laughs> pregnant. You're pregnant. P-R-E-G-N-A-N-T, I can spell. Well, Carlos, well, I remember like sitting there just going, oh my gosh, you kind of get lightheaded, you're overwhelmed with all these feelings, and I'm just like, uh, I, I have to tell Carlos, I have to tell Carlos, and like, I leave the restroom, and I guess I sounded really overwhelmed. I couldn't find him, but the way I was saying his name, I was like, Carlos, Carlos, <laughs> like, I was just so overwhelmed. Yeah, so I found her, and uh... No, you were, you were out. Yeah, outside, outside, and then I found you. Yeah. Right? And I was, I, but, well, instead of it being like this big romantic moment where I'm like, we're pregnant, yeah. I was just like, I was like, what's wrong, what's wrong, what's wrong? Oh. And, then, and then I literally, I thought it was a joke, and I started looking around. I was he like, was looking for cameras. I, I was like, is George filming? Oh, my husband. Right <laughs> no, but it was, it, but was it was real. Beautiful. It was a good moment. And I have to say, like, it's it's so nuts because it's so, it, you're, it, it's in the beginning stages. So nothing says that you're pregnant other than your pregnancy test, and you kind of cherish that. Like it's something. I don't want to throw away. I just want to like keep it forever, which might. I have it next to my bed. <laughs> he does. You have. You have. A, well, now it's down here. But I keep it next to my bed. You do. You in my nightstand. Is that weird that I keep your pee stick next to my nightstand? <laughs> and now you guys know. Now you guys. We can know. share the excitement. We can start vlogging about it. We can start posting about it. And yeah, I definitely I'm have pumped. a lot of things that I want to talk about. I mean, that boys probably don't want to hear, but women who are thinking about pregnancy, women who are pregnant women who've had children, I just feel like there's so much on this journey that we can share with each other totally. and that totally. that we can share to soon to be moms or people who want to be moms. So yeah. so let's get together. I want to answer questions. I want you guys to ask questions. 
Let's do this. All right, we gotta get going because we have to pack for the sailing trip that we're currently on right yes. now. We love you guys. God bless. Thank you so much for all the support uh, for Lexlos and. Uh, we're gonna have Lex Los and whatever that thing is, so now we gotta add a third name. Wait until we have to start packing with baby clothes. LL. Maybe we just do like another thing that has an L in it, so it's like LLL. Lilililil. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go. Bye! Save these pictures, I'll save the stick. Bye! I have two.